Hey everyone, it's Jo, what's up? And today is day number four of 31 days of Halloween makeup looks. So if you're interested in watching another one, this will be The Purge, then keep on watching. Um, I know it's a very basic look, but I'm thinking we can slightly elevate it. So I've done all my skincare, my primer, all that kind of thing. So I'm gonna start with my foundation, my Revolution foundation, you know the drill. This is in F6. Then just gonna use concealer in the matching shade. And then just gonna do a little bit of like contour bronzering with the matching concealer but in C14. When I'm not gonna do any more base makeup, so I'm just gonna use my setting spray. I always find that it's a bit much if I put it straight on my face, so I just kinda do a little trick like that. Then just gonna do my eyebrows and my Rimmel London pencil. I don't have any more eyebrow stuff at the moment unless you count. My eyeshadows, so we're just gonna continue using this. And so I'm just gonna use, this is a collection press powder and I'm just gonna press it into my chin. And I do notice it goes around my nose. So I'm just doing them once everything else is just getting set and spray. But you do you when it comes to how you set your makeup. I'm not sure about you, but I hate it when my eyes don't have something like on an everyday, like it's fine. But if I'm going out, I want something. So this is just Hula Bronzer and I'm putting it through my crease. That's all I'm doing to it. I'm then going to curl my eyelashes and just put a little bit of mascara on. Is the Scandal Eyes by Rimmel London. This is something I used a long time ago and I kind of just wanted a cheap mascara because I'm poor at the moment and Benefit, even though they're a lot better, they cost more. Worth the price, but I just can't afford that right now. base makeup we're gonna do and all the normal sort of makeup so you can use so many different things for these but I like to use a now realistically you can use any shade flat brush I'd recommend a small flat brush I'm gonna go the only ones I wouldn't recommend is the black just because it is difficult I would do this hot pink because I've never used it before. It's like a slightly berry pink and I'm just going to outline my whole face. No going back now. Now, you can see a big difference, but I am going to go over it now, but I do like to do the whole circle first. I like to do that one, but then I'm just going to do another line. Just going right through my mouth. I've got a really problem here at the moment. So this is not going like I would like it to. I have a massive dry patch right next to my mouth. I like that. And then we're just going to do X's along this line. I did the K.
want a tiny detail brush and then we're gonna go in with the very loved white. We're just gonna go around the whole thing again. I'll be honest, I'm not liking the fact I've got no thing on my lips, so I'm just gonna light that face paint with lipstick and to match everything because it actually looks kind of odd now. I don't know. What do you think? This is my purge look. A little bit elevated from last year. I hope you like it and I can't wait to see you in day number five.